The same 10 candidates we saw last time around will be on stage with the addition of Carly Fiorina, who was in the earlier so-called happy hour debate, who's now jumped up to the bigger group. What are they going to have to work with in this contest? They can't bring any phones with them, no tablets, no notes, no props. Each candidate will have a pad of paper and a pen and a glass of water. And what will they be facing? Well, our panel will be comprised of our moderator, Jake Tapper, also CNN's Dan Abash, and Hugh Hewitt from radio. They will be posing questions along with some questions that will be taken from social media, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and so forth. The subject matters are going to be foreign policy, domestic policy, and politics. Big, broad topics, and with so many people on stage, they will have narrow windows in which to answer. One minute per answer, 30 seconds if it's a rebuttal to something else that was said about you, and we will use timing lights to show the candidates if they are running out of time. And lest you think the people who are in the earlier debate are at a huge disadvantage, yes, they may very well have a smaller audience, but they'll also have a whole lot more time to express their ideas. And under the rules, if one of them says something that is particularly sharp or interesting, that video clip can be played in the larger debate, and those candidates will have to answer to it.